and my main research is in immersive virtual reality where we work at two levels. One, we try to understand why it works, uh, sec why it works in terms of human perception and so on. How comes that people go in these virtual environments and although they're quite poor compared with reality, people nevertheless respond to them realistically. And second, we use it as a tool in psychology and neuroscience. Now, for example, uh, we did a study where um, we look at how people respond to violence. So this is an, an important area in social psychology called the bystander problem. So if you're somewhere and you see two other people start fighting, uh, what do you do? Do you run away? Do you try to intervene? Do you, what, basically, what do you do? This is very hard to study in physical reality because you can't set up situations where violence breaks out for ethical reasons. But in virtual reality, you can because since people tend to respond realistically, you get genuine reactions from them. I think one of the most stunning things we found is that when you're in virtual reality, we can replace your body by a virtual one. So when you look down towards yourself, instead of seeing your real body, you'll see a virtual one. And as you move, the virtual one will move the same as you. So you can get these quite dramatic changes in people's attitudes, behavior, even their physiology, even their brain signals depending on what kind of body you, you, you give them in virtual reality. On the technical side, the challenges are, um, well, the more powerful the equipment and the software becomes, the more complex things we want to do. So we never really, we, well, of course we gain because we're always doing more complex things, but there's always something more complex that we want to do. So this drives the challenge of um, developing new technical algorithms to solve technical problems in the virtual reality. And also it gives us the challenge of, uh, now that we can do this, how can we apply it to problem X in psychology and neuroscience?